the Ford Flex straps on some impressive turbo power and handles better than any 4,600-pound minivan substitute should it still a big, hefty wagon with comfort at the top of its priority list we'd give it a 5 for performance. Right down the middle Ford's long-lived 3.5-liter V6 pulls the base flex rated at 287 horsepower and 254 pound-feet. It accelerates adequately and clicks through the 6 speeds on its automatic transmission without fuss. Gas mileage is better than with the turbo, but well below average for the 3-row class. We'd skip the all-wheel drive here, since it taps some of the available energy and runs up the gas bills go directly to the Turbo V6 on loan from the Taurus Shul sedan. Just keep in mind, it's an $8,200 price boost, thanks to a lot of extra equipment bundled with it, including all-wheel drive and 20-inch wheels. The 3.5-liter V6 kicks in 365 horsepower, all of which can be accessed via steering wheel mounted shift paddles. The transmission makes as much as it can from the power on tap. It shifts short of red line, but will hold a gear in mid-corner or a mid-hill climb. Once its sensors detect a flat road, back to the top gears it goes the flex delivers the handling you'd expect in a long wheelbase station wagon, though it blurs some into the crossover SUV category the ride is compliant, though it bounds in tight, deep corners if you hustle it through them quickly even the massive 20-inch wheels don't upset its smooth ride quality a few years ago Ford updated the flex's electric steering mounts and its brakes both systems are better for the attention the crisp steering lobes up evenly, and the brakes bite more strongly, 